four, five, six. We're running straight through these guys. Puchiena, not a rare. Into it. Oh! And boom. Okay, we got a hit. We these cards are so sick. It's hard to, like, it doesn't do justice on camera. I'm being so serious. Like, these are actually so sick. Back to the channel, my name is Zach Lugo, this is Pokelux, and I got my hands on one of the Arceus V-Star Premium Collection Boxes. These are an exclusive to GameStop, you can't get them anywhere else, and I'm so happy I got one of these, so thank you to my manager for picking this up for me. Say hi, Ambi. <laughs> but anyways, so I've seen a couple videos on the Arceus V-Star box, but I, uh... I haven't watched them because I don't want to spoil it for myself, so I'm super excited to see what kind of products are inside this. Before we crack this bad boy open, I just want to say thank you so much for all the uh, support recently on the videos. I'm giving away one $100 Amazon gift card to anyone that likes this video and subscribes to the channel and leave a comment down below and say done. And also leave a comment, let me know if you have any ideas for me for the channel. I do a great... I. A, <laughs> I greatly appreciate it. All right, so we got the Arceus V-Star box right here. This thing, I honestly thought it was gonna be a lot bigger, but it's like such small in hand. It's so small in hand, and it's actually really interesting. But all right, we are going to crack it open. We're gonna just slice the bottom of it right there. Sheesh, here we go. And it is cracked open. Umbi can play with the trash. Let's slide. Let's do it on the face cam. Let's slide it right out. We got the Arceus V Star right on the front right there. Wow, I'm actually now just looking at the back of it. There's 15 packs inside. Hello? Hello? One metal card featuring Arce. All right, I'm not going to spoil it. Two metal cards. Oh, yeah, this is lit. Let's go. So the. Look at the pattern. Look how, like, that's actually beautiful. Like, they did such a good job on this box. Look at this. Look at that pattern, ladies and gentlemen. I'm excited. So this just lifts up. It's not like the Ultra Premium collections recently that I've dropped, like where you just flip it open. It's not like a magnetic, just like all the other Ultra Premium collections. But let's get into this box. First things first. Hello? What? Do not tell me that they just threw these in here without any protection. Wow, these are sick though. Oh my gosh. So these guys, these are the metal cards. As you could tell, they are metal and not grading these obviously, as you could tell, I just smacked it with my finger. Uh, but these cards are so sick. It's hard to, like, it doesn't do justice on camera. I'm being so serious. Like, these are actually so sick. Love these. So that's the Arceus V Star. And then we got the Arceus V. This one has some cool texture like right here in the corner. I don't know if you guys can see that. And then the backs on these are really cool. That's sick. Let's go. It doesn't make sense. Why would they just throw them in the box and just let them fly around during shipment? Like, that's interesting. All right, let's see how much these go for in value. Okay, so according to uh, TCG Player, uh, which is one of the main sources that I use for pricing, the Arceus V has listings for $32. That's crazy. And the Arceus V Star has listings for $65. And they just, they literally went like this. And threw them in the box and closed it and shipped it away. What the fuck are they thinking, bro? Don't put them in any plastic. Don't put them in a uh, sealed, in a sealed little thing, nothing. All right, sorry, I'm triggered. That triggered me, I'm sorry. All right, so. 
first thing out of this is a really, actually I haven't seen it yet, but I'm guessing it's really cool. They have probably a really cool, I thought that landed in my hoodie. Ready? Oh, it's upside down. Dude, I do that, I swear I've done that every time. But we got the Arceus V Star coming straight through the galaxy. Excuse me, Umbi? Little quiet? Can you be a little quiet over there? We got the R. Then we have this little, uh, oh, dude, the patterns on this box mixed with my greasy, <clears throat> <clears throat> mixed with my greasy fingers. Love it. Also, guys, if you haven't already, go follow my Instagram, my Pokemon Instagram account. I'll link it in the description. Show some love there. Um, it's gonna be really fun. All right, what do we got? What do we got? I low-key want to keep this box. I feel like I could use it for something, for sure. Okay, first off, why can't they throw the Arceus V-Star? I'm going right back to this. Why can't they throw the Arceus V-Star in the box? <laughs> Pisses me off, man. It's actually ridiculous. Okay, V-Star marker that no one cares about. We got the dice that people do care about. And, oh, <clears throat> oh, oh, we got a little coin, bud. All right, let's see. Let's, hello, can I open it? All right, we have the Arceus coin. This thing is pretty sick. It's, it's already scratched, so we love that for us. Um, and now, the packs. So the box itself, $100. Very cool box. Um, the play mat is probably around $10, $15, maybe less. The metal cards are roughly Market price, I mean, it. market price is already $90, so I mean, the packs right here, if we could pull a ton of value in these packs, we would be sitting nice. Um, but let's not count the gold cards, because I'm not going to sell them. Well, I'm not going to sell anything, but let's not count the gold cards into the value. Let's just say the playmat's $10, all right? We need to try to pull $90 worth of packs without the gold cards to reach our $100 mark of the box. Let's get right into it. Let's, okay, first off, let me show you the selection. We have two Lost Origin, nice. We have two Astral, two Brilliant, two Evolving, two Lost, two Astral, two Brilliant, and... Why would they put, why would they put a random Vivid Voltage? The Rainbow Pikachu is the hardest card to pull in mankind and it is literally only 200 in a PSA 10. Anyways, kind of ridiculous, I know. We'll start with Vivid, and we'll just go through. Vivid Voltage. That would be really funny if we pulled the Rainbow Pikachu right now. Dude, no freaking way. Code card, one, two, three, four, five, six. We're running straight through these guys. Poochiena, not a rare, into it. Oh, cute little Snorlax, let's go. You know, you have to show love to some of the hollows, even though they are most of the time dog. Brilliant stars, can we pull the rainbow Charizard? Bro, rainbow Charizard V-Star would be so cool. Or the Altar Charizard, you know? One, two, three, four, five, and six, and boom. I, d I did the card trick wrong. Boom, Spear Tome, and boom. Okay, we got a hit, we got a Zerud V. We'll take any hit. I just bit my tongue. Ten thousand dollars in a PSA one. No, I'm just kidding, guys. It's a uh, Zerud V is sixty-seven cents. Like I, I'm like acting like I got you guys. I'm like just kidding. One, two, three, four, five. Six. I don't even know what pack this is. What pack is this? Motham? That is a rare, but who cares about Motham? Let's be honest. Into a Mewtwo, non-hollow. Still a cool card. Get that shit out of my face. Astro Radiance, let's go, baby. The code cards flipped backwards. Okay, maybe a sign. Three, four, five, six. And Astro Radiance. We need uh we need Machamp. 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 Okay, okay. Dark Rye V. We'll take that. We'll take it. I'm not ripping it, don't worry. Okay, Dark Rye V. 76 cents, guys. We are balling. Another Astro Radiance. We're looking for the Altar Beedrill. I have not pulled that, even though hate. I hate Beedrill. Little backstory on Beedrill. I bought 
my first ever base set booster pack, a base set unlimited booster pack from Pokeref. All right, it was unweighed obviously, and I pulled a non-holo Beedrill, and ever since then I hate Beedrill. Hasui anti-explosion, okay. Let's freaking go. Okay, we're almost, we almost hit the dollar mark. 96 cents on this V card right here. Kiram, baby. I mean, at least we're hitting, but we're just not hitting the ones that we're chasing, if that makes sense. One dollar and six cents. Hey, the Vs are getting slower, slow. The Vs are slowly getting more expensive. So, I mean, hey, maybe we'll, maybe what's next? A two dollar V, if that's even possible. Code card. One, two, three, four, five, six. I'm noticing that a lot of these cards are like warped. Like, can you tell? Like, it's a little warped. Okay, we have a Snorlax character rare. And we have something behind it. What, what we got, what we got? Come on, come on. <laughs> Let's go. Little double banger, double banger. I need a shut up, dude. I have way too much fun opening cardboard, shiny cardboard, man. It's so much fun. But I know, I know a lot of you relate. I know a lot of you relate. Snorlax, okay, Snorlax is two dollars and sixteen cents. That's a W. Electrode going for four dollars and twelve cents. That's actually pretty good for a full art. Four bucks. We're rich. <laughs> Alright, we go. We're gonna save, or actually gonna save these two evolving packs for the end because that is my all-time favorite set of uh, Sword and Shield. Um, sadly, Sword and Shield is coming to an end, but I'm super excited at the same time. All right, here we go. Code card: one, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, we got a Shinx, not a rare. Super cute though. Into nothing. All right, we got a Brilliant Stars. <clears throat> what we got in here, bro? What we got? Code card one, two, three, four, five, six. Dude, that'd be sick if we could actually pull some bangers. I think I just jinx it every time, man. Every time. <laughs> what am I doing? <laughs> Code card. One, two, three, four, five, six. Come on, we have a barboach. And another an <laughs> another dark guy, bro. Bangers right now. Also, let me know in the comments if hollows are hits. <laughs> Do you think hollows are hits? Person. We got a hoot hoot. Can we please get a double banger? That would be so sick. Hoot hoot character rare. Look how stunning this artwork is. Like, bro. And the centering on this card is amazing. I'm going to grade this one. And okay, we do have a Gallade hollow hit. Psych, that is not a hit. Oh, this card is... The edges are really, like, not rounded, but, like, the centering is amazing on this card. Who has ever liked Hoot Hoot until this artwork? Let's be honest. This dollar, this this card is a dollar thirty-nine. All we really need is that alternate art from Evolving Skies. One, two, three, four, five, and six. And what we got, what we got? Sableye. Can we pull the Giratina? That would be freaking sick. Or the Aerodactyl. One, two, three, four, five, six. What we got? What we got? What we got? Swana and two. It's okay. It's okay. Two primed. These packs have. Know your fucking place, trash. <laughs> Robots. <laughs> Frick that little fox. Okay, last pack of the opening. Make sure you smash that like button, guys. I do appreciate all the support. Goes a long freaking way, bro. One, two, three, four, five, six. All right, can we do it on the channel? No, you're. That'll be it, guys. Thank you for watching. Uh, we pulled absolute bangers. Um, smash that like button. Subscribe if you haven't already. And I'll see you. In another video, Pokelux is our baby. Let's go.